Hello all. Today we are going to see uh, how to send uh, email using Flow. Uh, for that, I'm going to take this as a use case. Uh, like contact should be receiving an email when the case status is changed to close. So whatever the contact that is uh, attached to the case should get an email whenever they're closing the case. So that's our use case. Let's see how we can achieve this scenario. All right, uh, I have logged into Salesforce and I'm going to create a new flow. And for this, I'm going to choose record triggered flow. Create and the object should be case. And the criteria trigger is created or updated and after the record is saved, that is fine. Okay, so here I'm gonna get records. Now pick this case and the conditions this should be equal to closed and we have to pass the ID right so I am gonna select case ID equals record ID. So only if the condition matches, then our flow going to trigger now the records. And I'm going to leave other fields as this. And then I'm going to connect the dots. Okay, we are we have get the records and we are going to send the email, right? For that we have to drag the action element and select email this is the uh, action that we are going to use for send email email and the body so body just you can give whatever you want this is this closed and yep subject is closed and the email address so here uh, I'm going to add this email address here the comma separated one it's not a comma separated but yeah uh, we are going to choose case email so this is what our requirement is right like we are going to send uh, email to um, contact when the uh, case is closed so i am choosing the contact email here uh, pretty much yes that is it uh, then just connect it and save Okay, save and activate. Okay, it's activated now. Let's check. Let's create a case. And see whether we are getting the email. Okay, I'm going to create a new case. Contact All right, okay, Sergeant is email. 
hopefully the case is created now and let's quickly check okay contact is having this email let's close this case let's close save all right case is closed let's go ahead and see got it we have got the email so it says case is closed that's all guys so it's it's pretty simple uh, just you have to create the action and uh, you can map it and you, you, you can also play around uh, with this uh, template so here um, where is it okay in the body i have just given this uh, thing hard coded right so here you can remove this and go ahead and create a new resource and say it's a text template template and here you can see your case and you can insert the case number so uh, if you add this one then they will get this email template with the case number relevant case number attached to it so you can uh, play around with this by adding whatever the data and the values that you wanted to uh, add here uh, that is it that all that's all i wanted to share in this video let me know you have any questions over um, the scenario and i'll see if at all i can help you that's all guys thank you bye, -bye.